It's starting to look like a walk in the park, but construction of Nicolette Mall was anything but. We began utility work in 2015. We started the roadway work in June of 2016 and will be uh, completed in November of 2017. Progress is undeniable. Take a look at this footage shot in February 2016 compared to now. Today we have 75% of the intersections have been fully restored to traffic. The remaining intersections will be open by Labor Day. Don Elwood with Minneapolis Public Works says this means less congestion downtown. One of the key features of the Nickel Mall is the raised intersections. Making it easier for people to get around. Nicollet Mall is a signature street not only to the city of Minneapolis but the state of Minnesota. So Nicollet Mall is a gem. And that's partly due to the artwork along the mall. The old art we took off the mall, cleaned it up and that's starting to come back. We also have new art with the mall and one of those is the Ned Con Prairie Tree. And according to the Minneapolis Downtown Council, this adds vibrancy and vitality to existing and prospective businesses on Nicollet. We have a new bar and restaurant that recently opened on Nicollet Mall, Hopcat. Nordstrom Rack is set to open in September. It was said best decades ago, but today, those lyrics, we're going to make it after all, gives a whole new meaning to the new Nicollet Mall. In Minneapolis, Zachary Lajway, CARE 11 News. Well, Target is wrapping up its multi-million dollar renovation around Nicollet Mall. Tonight, the Minneapolis Downtown Council says a $10 million redevelopment project is underway in the former Macy's building, and another $10 million investment is being worked out for the former Barnes & Noble space.